This is Emmet. Oh. <laughs> Emmet is a magnet. Uh, and we use Emmet to track uh, my 3D motion. And I'm drawing in space using that, using Emmet's information. So we have a normal tablet pen here, and we've uh, surgically implanted a little magnetic sensor. So that's how I, I can uh, draw in 3D. Transform is a standard pose-to-pose -pose animation tool. So you go in and draw your key poses and edit your timing in the timing graph and Sandy will interpolate between the poses. I also put a displace on this one to flip him right side up, which you can do by grabbing him like he's a puppet and moving it how you want it. With the polypose tool, you define several poses. Here I have poses A, B, C, and D. Sandy generates a 3D polygon which you can move around in to interpolate between your poses. So I'm not stuck with going from pose A to pose B. I can go from pose A, B, or C, or D uh, with influence from any other pose. The closer I am to a corner, the closer it is to that pose. But wherever I am in the middle of that volume, every other pose still has an effect on my drawing. And the nice thing about it is that when I finally find the walk cycle, I'm going to record it and it will have the timing of my actual hand gestures. So if I want to give it a certain hurry character, I can just hurry my hand. If I want, if I want it to just go slow motion, I go slower, I can mix it up. Basically, spine work uses a spine straight axis that, that, that I place through the drawing to manipulate the whole volume of the drawing. So when I move this spine, everything around it warps. So you can see the straight axis moving underneath them. 